how to take creatine HCI. I'm going to explain that to you today. So today I bought creatine HCI. It's, this particular one is made by a company called Caged. It starts with a K. And I got this because I was told that it doesn't require loading as creatine monohydrate requires and it doesn't have as much water retention as creatine monohydrate. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how I make this according to the instructions. If you read on the side, it says other ingredients, there are none. It says this is a dietary supplement, take one serving with approximately four to six ounces of water. Patent, patented creatine HCI can be taken on an empty stomach with food or with other flavored caged products. If you are not consuming other six sources of creatine, consume two servings with six to eight ounces of water pre and post workout. Non training days consume four servings all at once upon waking up with eight to twelve ounces of water. Now because I'm going to be working out I'm going to take two servings with six to eight ounces of water. So I have my glass right here. This full is about eight ounces of water. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and add the water to this glass first about six to eight ounces and then I'm going to go ahead and add the creatine HCI all right so that's about 6.7 ounces I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and it says servings if you look on the side it says one scoop is equivalent to one serving so I'm gonna take two scoops of this this comes with a scoop very small right here. So I'm just going to go ahead in here. There is a silicon dioxide pack. Now that is just to keep the creatine HCI dry. So I'm going to take one level scoop, drop it into the water. Then I'm going to take a second scoop and drop it into the water. Now that brings me up to two servings into the water, into six to eight ounces of water. So what I'm going to do is, once it's in there, I'm going to go ahead and stir this. And by the looks of it, it looks like it dissolves pretty well. I'm just going to keep on spinning it or mixing it just to make sure that all of the creatine HCI is dissolved. So now that I have that creatine HCI, I'm going to go ahead and try it just like this. And if you look inside of the glass, it's completely clear. Looks like all of the creatine HCI was dissolved, and I'm going to go ahead and try it now. Now it has <clears throat> a little bit of tartness to it. Wasn't expecting that, but it wasn't too bad. It's very tolerable. And what I like about it the most is there is no, um, the water retention is less compared to creatine monohydrate. So that's creatine HCI. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks a lot for watching.